Um, tell me, guys, what do you have coming up in the, first, in the near future? Well, right now we um, we do have a, a single out and it's featured on our website, callmebadmusic.com. That's bad with two Ds. Um, all the proceeds, 100% of the proceeds, are going to the uh, Red Cross to help out with the uh, the tragedy that happened in Oklahoma with the tornadoes and all the tornadoes and all families that were devastated. You know, we're from Oklahoma. Uh, Brian actually lives in Oklahoma still, so. We're, we've always wanted to give back, and, and this is an opportunity for us to do so, as well as to also, you know, um, launch our new website. Um, also, people can follow us on Twitter at the Economy Back, um, and you know, we just expects you know new music from us as well, because what we want to do, no disrespect to anybody or what's going on right now, but as we've been traveling, we've heard a lot of people say, "Man, it's so refreshing to hear the acapella and the real." music and the vocals and things like that so we want to the harmonies yeah and so we want to bring that back we want to bring the romance back we want to bring the lyrics back we want to bring the feel-good music and the real vocals you know? i love it so with so many groups you know coming together and then breaking up yeah tell me a little bit about how you guys were able to have such longevity in this business because it, it's a beast so i would say um what did it for us is we were brothers first we were family first we weren't a group that was placed together. There weren't auditions. Kevin and I actually have known Kevin since I was in the sixth grade. You know, we went to junior high together. We were in choir. He was kind of like my mentor in, in, in the junior three. high. <laughs> Seriously. Wow. <laughs> Seriously, yeah. And uh, we ended up going to uh, high school with Mark and, and Sam. And so those guys were friends from childhood up. So we were just, you know, the whole color me bad thing. We, our name was Take One first started. Yeah, I remember Levi's that. guys went through a lot of stages and people just kept bringing it to our attention that we were a multi-faceted, multi-cultured group. And so we thought, you know, maybe we should, you know. And so uh, that's the one that stuck. Color yeah, bad. but yeah. see, that's what was so funny about it is we're still together, I guess, because, you know, brothers have fights. Yeah. Brothers get along, but they, you know, they have their, their, their little, what do you call it, their little moments or whatever, but families do. You know, that doesn't mean you quit and give up and just turn your backs on one another. And so we were a family and brothers first. Well, that'll always be first. And one of the main elements for the jail, keep everything as God. Put God first, man. We put the Lord first, and you know, everything else falls into place. Okay, one last question? Yes. Okay, um, where do you see music going right now? You see people starving for that harmony and, <laughs> and those real vocals and, and, and live live music. Yeah. You know, they're starving yeah. for it. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong, there's a lot of the stuff that they play on the radio that I love. Right. But you can kind of get too much of a good thing or you can overdo it, you know. And so, you know, I mean, just like John Legend, Alicia Keys, Bruno you know, Mars, Bruno Mars oh. they, they, they're right there and they, they keep it going. Um, but we kind of, we, we want to just step back in and, and take up where we left off. Yeah. You know, just keep, keep doing what we love to do, which is good music. Well, we absolutely love you, and I thank you so much for your time. Yeah. Thank you. God bless you. Absolutely. We definitely look for new things from you. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you.